year, and this is my custom unicorn that I've already done a video on, but yeah, this is her. But my point here is to have a barn tour. Yeah, she like a barn tour. And, um, yes, it is very sparse. It'll be like a one or two minute one. But it's right before my birthday. My birthday party is next Sunday. And today's Sunday, so I've got a week from t today to wait for my birthday party. And I'm hoping to get a bunch of schlikes to put in my barn. And a few schlikes sets as far as, like, riding arenas and stables and stuff. Anyway, please enjoy and please like, comment, and subscribe. Like, yay. Um, sorry about that. Okay, I'll just leave my unicorn here. And this is an aerial view of my barn. Um, my room is tiny, so that's also why it's very small and cramped. So, yeah. But anyway, I guess I should start at the, this barn. This is my, um... I got this at Feldman's for like 45 bucks when it's usually like 123 because it's missing, it was missing some parts. Like the window pieces, the door, some of the doors. Like at least it wasn't missing those doors. Um, but yeah, I've got, it's my feed room slash tack room. My tack room is down here, but the loft is basically the feed room. I made eight of those two days ago. All eight of them took me about two hours. It was a very sticky job. And then I've got my mean cat Chloe. I've got one of my bareback saddles. I mean bareback pads. My uh, uh, rope. Uh, like, you know, roping. I don't know. And all my feed. I'm hoping to get a lot more. But, yeah. And if you're wondering why I have stud cubes at Senior feed is because I have a senior heat horse and I have a brood mare in my stable which I'm guessing I'll probably get a lot more okay so this so our first stop is the medical clinic I've got Daniel in here hello Daniel um, and he's um, checking on Sonora she was named after the Sonoran Desert in Arizona, but that's her owner, Jessie. Her little old cage. His computer, his shelf. Which that thing is prone to getting with spiders. And that's the examination table. But yeah, two medical stalls. Pretty cute. By the way, this is all made by hot glue, wood, and a lot of painstaking hours. Okay, so this is Reese, the golden retriever. And then back here is Tioga, named after the Tioga Road in Yosemite. Then there is little Ace. Um, that's Clyde's stall. And then I've got uh, mm, Pablo. Pablo, yes. He's a show jumper. He's a very nice horse. Then that's my brood mare. Little, little Miss San Savannah. That's their foal. She's actually going to have another. And, yeah. And that is, um, that's Danielle's horse. I know, there's a Daniel and a Danielle. I couldn't think of any better names, so just bear with me. Anyway, oh, my dogs fell down. My dogs. These those two are easy to stand up. But that's Johnny, that is Lily's father, and Reese is Lily's mother. And then I've got Clyde, who's our beautiful Clydesdale in here, who's just getting untacked. Well, she really doesn't look like much, but she just got started untacking him. But, um, I will start making these. These are bareback pads, like a whole bareback set. And they're really easy. They're easy to put on, easy to take off. They won't break. They are kind of a little ugly, but 
I do make them for um, drafters unless you specifically ask. You don't, like, you want a certain horse. But I can only do certain horses since I only have these horses right now, but um, soon I will have different horses. But, yeah. So these are bareback pads and they're just felt and little like lobster clasp, a little lobster clasp, a ring, and hot glue to glue down the knots. If you don't mind a little bit of hot glue showing them, then they're perfect for you because they're t they take about 10 minutes to make and I will make them for you if you give me two bucks and you tell me which two colors you want for your pad and which rope and which cord color you want for the reins. I mean the bridle and the reins. Um I have to destroy this. Anyway, it's kind of a mess. I'm probably gonna have to get more, but this is my silver. Got rain rainbow, bronze, pastel rainbow, and in green. So, you can choose from those, and then I've got, as, as, right, as of right now, I've got teal felt, dark green felt, yellow felt, pink felt, barely any pink felt, and purple felt. But I'm going to get more, because they're at Walmart for like a dot, like, you know, 60 cents. They're super cheap. But anyway, yeah. Um... And this is my main barn. As you can tell, it's pretty empty. And random food trough. <laughs> Made out of cardboard. And that is Espresso. He's my senior horse here. He's an old boy. He used to be a show jumper. Now he's an old boy. That's the Nora stall. But as you can see, she's sick. And then there's my paddock. Which is completely empty with my trash can. Yeah. So anyway, yeah, this is my barn. And please don't mind the mess. But um yeah. The this is my barn tour. It took a long time. It took me about two weeks to make a lot of painstaking hours during summer and yeah so anyway I hope you enjoyed and as I said in the first video please like comment and subscribe and everyone will be happy Woo anyway see ya